So summer's coming. Are we ready for this season on the mountain? I know I am. It's been a rough winter. Some of the old timers, I guess I'm one of those now, said they haven't seen a winter like this in a lot of years. I know from personal experience that winters 40 years ago were like this. Since I moved back home to Wyoming in 210, there has not been a winter like this one. This next summer we'll see some changes to our YouTube channel, as well as our other social media platforms. The biggest change will be our full length fly fishing video. Fishing is not a sport, or is it? I am definitely looking forward to that. That's going to be this fall. I will also be posting my everyday carry when on the water. By everyday carry, I mean the stuff I carry when I go fly fishing. As most of you know, the Bighorns are not the only place to fly fish in Wyoming. We have Flat Creek that is located in the National Elk Refuge, only a few minutes outside of Jackson. The Grovant River flows out of the Grovant Wilderness. The Miracle Mile is located in central Wyoming between Pathfinder and Cortez. It has great populations of monster rainbow trout and brown trout that can weigh north of 10 pounds. I can attest to that as my brother's a guiding Casper, and I get the opportunity to fish with him. Our grandparents lived in Converse County, and Grandpa used to say the state was managing the plat very well, and one day it would become the best in the state and probably the best in the USA. I think it's achieved that. The Green River originates in Bridger Teton and is terrific as well. With six major mountain ranges and many other minor ranges, there are a lot of great places to fly to. Undoubtedly, the skill needed to make the most of fly fishing is well above traditional fishing. Not to say that regular fishing doesn't require skill, just that fly fishing requires you to fine tune your skills. If you're someone who loves a challenge, this sport is something you need to get your hands on. You'll be battling against the fish in the area, trying to outsmart them with your artificial flies. Even though the amount of research required before you go fly fishing can be a challenge, anglers need to learn about the different fish species, their primary food sources, and where they're likely to be. When on the water, you need to keep track of insect and fish movements to find the best spots. There's no doubt that fly fishing is the perfect combination of a workout and a puzzle. Your main objective is to put all the pieces together so that you can win the game. It's a gratifying feeling when you get the hang of the perfect cast with the perfect fly.
A generation of my time There is nothing we can 